Good morning, Parkview Pandas. This is Addison. And this is Chase. Snow is so much fun. I love scrunching around it. Having snow, uh, scrunching around it, having snowball fights, going sledding, and building snowmen. Unfortunately, there hasn't been much snow in the winter. How is it made? High up in the clouds, the temperature is really cold. At this time of year, the water vapor that's in the air turns to ice crystals. The ice crystals form around tiny bits of dirt that has been carried up into the atmosphere by the wind. Snowflakes are made by from these ice crystals. Each snowflake is, is six-sided and made of as many micro-sized as two, 200 tiny, <laughs> tiny ice crystals. As the snowflakes grow, they become heavier and fall toward the ground. Each snowflake is completely different. That's amazing. Light and fluffy snow is often called powder when we get a really heavy snowfall. It's called a snowstorm. A blizzard happens when there are snowstorms with very strong winds. Blizzards can be really dangerous for people driving on roads. Snow is not really white. It actually has no color. It looks like it's white from reflections from the sun, no matter how little sun is there is. Snow is used for winter sports like downhill and cross-country skiing snowboarding, and sledding. Hopefully we'll get some snow for winter break so I can maybe build a snow fort and go skiing at Welch Village with my family. We're signing off on the PNN News. Have a wonderful day, Parkview Pandas. Think snow! Now let's all stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States, States of America, America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.